All right, what's up, Hot Squad, and welcome back to my Heartbreaking Recap Marathon. So we're going to check out Zephyr's newest recap of Black Panther, and this title recap is called, When Martin Luther King Monger Fought Black Panther on African Soil. <laughs> hilarious, hilarious time, man. Man, I don't know how in the world he keep coming up with these titles, these you know, recaps. I mean, it's freaking hilarious. So, yes, Hot Squad, it's another Black Panther recap from DP YouTube, of course. Last time I did one was for Casper, and I enjoyed it. He actually had two of these. That's one of my first time I ever, ever reacted to Casper's recaps ever. So, check those ones out. If you've not seen those ones, it's hilarious. I know I did earlier this year. But, yes, Hot Squad, for more Zed Fire time, baby, it's finally, finally Zed Fire time. You know, I love this recap so much. So, without further ado, we ain't gonna waste no time. I'm ready to get this over with today just to catch up on everything I missed out on. So, Hot Squad, we're gonna check out Zed Fire's Black Panther recap right now. Let's check it out. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. What's good with y'all, bro? I'm finally back from vacation. I was up in the motherland of Congo, so there's no better time to drop a Black Panther <laughs> video than right here. And whenever my videos go up and reach the uncle, that's my intro music. <laughs> culture, they always like, well, I ain't saying the Edward, bro. They're not even black. Can you shut up? So for this video, even though everyone I'm talking about is black, I'm not gonna say that word a single time. Nice. Watch this, DJ Playma. <laughs> And the scene starts with Martin Luther King Monger getting ready <laughs> to Monger. take over the world. And after hearing his reasoning, I don't even blame him. We got Africans around the world eating meat meal meals while no, the Wakandans no. are out here living lavish. What you know about Fufu and Kwanga? Like, damn, bro, you can't share? Got T'Challa saying Africa can fight for themselves. Ghana can't even fight their way into good jalap. But Killmonger out there laying siege, spreading the troops out, saying, I want you to put the word out there. Back. He's just doing this for the good of the country. More Somali women for me. How can I not blame <laughs> Oh, also by the way, um, speaking of Michael B. Jordan, he actually got his movie, new movie out called Sinners recently from Ryan Coogler. A trailer just dropped. I haven't seen it yet. I'm, I'm holding it out for next week, y'all. I'm holding that out for next week. It's on Trump. Yes, but they missed. But I can't let y'all do nothing. And while they yapping, all they hear is. <laughs> And the plane crashing like a Nigerian That's movie. Crazy. They all run over to see what's up and peep how my man rises. There you go. <laughs> Keep it. And you see the goat rise up, staring his entire country yep. down. With the mask unveiled too, I felt the aura five minutes back. I'm tripping. <laughs> and my dog said, Jack And I'm like, wait. Wait, wait, I never yielded, and I was like, oh, stop, we get it a banger, you say you never what? I never yielded, you say you swear, swear, and I know y'all see everyone blazing that shadow trailer, but it's looking real familiar, I'm noticing, uh, I'm noticing, oh god, damn, get off that nigga dick, bro, and my man really put his hands up, he wanted the fade, the smoke, the scrap, brother, the squatch, only for Killmonger to be like, <laughs> No, nigga. We don't run the ones no more. I'm the king now. Got my dog sounding like he nigga at 30. But all that got to Chala tight, and you know Africans when they're angry. And you see, I am not dead. Nigga, was that a cough, Goofy? I'll just clear my throat. Oh, my friend, I just told you, I'll just clear my throat. Why are you talking to? That's what you're talking to. So you arrive into my country with that catastrophic disaster. On your head, <laughs> Mr. Rasta man. Hey, let me tell you something. Man, I done got him started, bro. Man, what cop <laughs> kill this clown? Is this nigga serious? <laughs> Even his wife knew this was smoke he couldn't handle. She was like, oh, no. <laughs> with Black Panther slowly approaching and KSI talking about some. KSI. Yes, it left bro with a choice, but sadly, <laughs> he picks the worst option. Just wait till they get out video. This Enderman never learns. Only listens to the person that is two thirds Drake. He hit that oh, bottle no. drop. <laughs> If 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 Zephyr is talking about doing a get out video, I would love to see that. If you do a recap for that, man, that would be so great. Hey, and all of my brothers run at the brother, yes. and my friend puts on that mask. Hey, he went prime minister, and all of them start to run at Black Panther. But nah, yes. rewind the footage because I really caught him. Mo, why are you geeked? This yes. underground railroad really pulled up to hate watch with a bathrobe and no cut. With yes. young boy on Dirk, ain't even brushed his teeth and went straight to the studio. I can feel his breath through the song. Yes. And while they all charging, the Jada Pickett army goes to Jada stop Pickett. him, okay? And we see my boy Killmonger shred the drip and dog. Oh, oh, man. Oh, man. What the fuck? That 
Get your ass. <laughs> nah, what is this? That pose actually was was fire though. I love how it rips straight into a suit. I love that. Bro, you A trains, we do it anything. There is clearly a difference between an African posing and an African American. <laughs> Where is the sauce? We're losing recipes. <laughs> like they really got my boy posing like he a figurine. Like man, if you don't get your ass. The pose was so bad that shorties was like, oh, oh, you're right. I think he got cooties. <laughs> Leaving just the top four. Lexus Luther starts it off, but they move it mad extra for no reason. These Africans always got a showboat. You did not need to use her back to vault at him, bro. You could have just jumped at bro. I don't know. But while they all boxing, we got Black Panther in the field straight moving. Even in that zoomed out shot, you can see my man straight juking in the field. Get this night skin on the Ravens. Lamar Jackson feel me, but I know you won't. If I have to see another Taylor Swift Super Bowl with Kermit Mahomes, I might but my brothers put the shields up and the king jumps in the air like a lion and puts all of them to rest. My king! But hold on, I can't even glaze yet. He ain't finished because peep this lead pass into the VTOL and he ends the streak with the Dodge finesse as the finisher. <laughs> Sensational. Had me watching this old play like I'm Michael Irving blazing the Dallas Cowboys. But we take a look at the field and everyone out there beefing. Whole house mad. But we get back to Wakabi and bro, what is this, bro? I am so sorry. You cannot make going down the hill tough no matter how hard you try. Just give it up. Wakabi in his maintained fried brain tried to get T'Challa through vibranium, brother. You stupid. Man, get your up. Got him flying to the bench. And T'Challa's all like, Wakabi, stop this! And look at him get it up like an angry child, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Is that tears, bro? bro? He skedaddles onto the rocket and hits that. No! <laughs> <laughs> And my dog got the rhinos busting through the dough like they GDs. GDs might sound crazy, but it's a good comparison. These rhinos were moving mad. People out the Tyler got up out the way. He ain't dealing with that. And they was out there wilding. Any Tupac head shape they seen, it was tough. They had the Black Air Forces tight, tight. They was catching bodies. But them bodies mean nothing to someone like T'Challa. He runs right there with them. And then it's a... Oh, it's it puts that boy down for the count and then speeds for more smoke. This motherfucker don't miss. <laughs> no, he's good. That motherfucker <laughs> don't miss, man. He's good. And I know <laughs> some of y'all saying, zip up his pants when you're done, bro. Gang, there won't be no pants. No, Especially no, after this no, play, no, y'all gonna no, agree no. with me. I want you to watch how he does this. <laughs> Too soon for that, Zephyr. Too soon. Go on now. This group of 5% tints. Throw it to the rollover. Runs right in, kick to the chest, spin move and knock in the sun and brings out this Kyrie. Like, nah, I literally can't. Who's doing it like this? Peep the instant replay. The way he's backing these blacks up, you think he's prime Kamala Harris. But one of the rhinos lands up crit, sending them across the battlefield and lays them out on the floor. But as y'all can clearly see, the battlefield's looking crazy. But while they boxing, they switch to Shuri underground and bro, look! They got my dog in a shiesty, bro. That's my wigger. Got me watching this like, hey, you all right, my boy? But I really don't get why they covered bro up, dog. He's white. You can't tell? Like, nah, this frying me. This period of plot to put sad plan. This the most useless shiesty of all time next to Mr. Beast. This ninja's ops is taxes. Now, we gonna get to Shuri and Nakia later, but Ross, I'm not gonna lie, his part is so boring. They had him out here playing Star Fox for 30 minutes. Yeah. I'm gonna at least mention it, but I'm not covering that bullshit. <laughs> Do you excuse me? He logging off. <laughs> But we get back to him. Well, I freaking love these edits, man. I love these edits. Martin Luther King Monger against a low hairline five. <laughs> he out there bobbing and weaving their attacks effortlessly. Nick Cannon dodging fatherly oh, obligations. He kicks the shorty back and grabs her. And now nah, this King Vaughn is really wild. And what is this? I can't even play that sound clip of this, this nigga is crazy. crazy. Because this man is deranged. It's even worse when they switch the angle, you sick bastard. What is wrong with you? This is a look you give yourself in the mirror when you crack in another man's bra. <laughs> the ones who know, know. If you're on the receiving end, that's wouldn't let that shit happen to me, go. though. But Shadi went out like a G. She came correct. Hit him with the It's Killmonger K till death, bitch. Wakanda forever. <laughs> and he packs her up. Now, this obviously gets the whole gang type, but this team right here had me type confused. Because, dog, who is she feeling like? You are not Goku. You really need to put the anime down, bro. I'm about to see her power up moving like these. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> they all get to charge it and look at Killmonger, bro. <laughs> Y'all Jackie Robinsons get veneers and all of a sudden you love smiling. But we just carry weep, stupid, sidestep into a box. This is actually sad. He got her on the floor like Jaden Smith, but he's doing them bad. Turns him into such free eats. I see Quinsley in the back one and next. But then the Queen Latifah's remembered. Queen Latifah. <laughs> we can jump him and decide to attack him all at once. Drake him relate and actually Damn. get some locked down. And then we got Okoye over here screaming in Ningala. And Killmonger <laughs> knew they was trying to take the drip. And he was not going to let that slide. And he uses an AOE to pack them all up. In the moment they get thrown, we get two more shorties running in for smoking. And I know you see her right yeah, here, though. Yeah, She's man, so go. bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we need more black actresses in these movies because we damn near 60 videos in. Hey, and we just now videos, got wow. to a movie with some beautiful black queens. I can't even blame Black Panther for saying he never freezes in the movie. And once he saw her, he was like, okay. And I know there's at least yep. five lame ninjas watching this video and two of them go comment. Oh, Zeph. All I got is two reasons. One, she can't be attractive. She don't even have hair. And number two, she's black. And I got number three, brother, kill yourself. I don't care if she black, blue, or bald. I'm pulling up to her daddy crib like ease. Are you grasping the pretzels, daddy? <laughs> what type of daddy are you, at? What type of She charges in and look at Killmonger, bruh. That's how you know this man's crazy. Look at his face. He ain't even trying to save black people anymore. He forgot his permission. She throws a discus and my boy hits a 40 foot lunge. Like, damn. Only to get sprayed by Shuri. Had him hit in the Torica. And get sliced in the back mid dance. He swipes back and she locks his arm, finessing his weapon and straight stun locking Cody. My dad, sir. That's my mom. With Shuri spraying him in the back and the Kia taking his other weapon, you would really think this was over. Like my attraction to her just went from 10 to uncalculable. I never expected her to cook like this. Now, gun to the back of your head, name a Hawkeye scene as good as that. You're dying, buddies. But they have a hand to hand block and she goes for a left. He weaves and hits her with the. <laughs> Shotty like a mixtape hit in the big trust. Uh, by the way, speaking of Lupita Nyong'o, she was really good in Quiet Place Day One, and I think she got the White Robot coming out from DreamWorks this Friday, I believe. I just lost my Look at my wife. <laughs> But I can't help but watch this disappointed. She was cooking this much and got taken out by a scratch. It reminded me of them Dragon Ball movies when the side <laughs> character would get the coldest intros of all time, only to land one hit and get shoved aside and contribute yeah. a thing. So if they go on Cactus Jack and kill my girl goes to ISO Shuri, and I'm so sorry, that poor thing ain't show up with nothing but a mouse good tool. <laughs> she got a hoe. And it's already showing because she lets off two shots. And when they switch the angle, we dead only see one. Yeah. Damn. I don't even know where that other one went. She can't even aim right. Look at her face. Who gave her the blinks? She tried to play some sonic waves of African screaming to stun lock him in place because for some reason Africans think screaming fixes all problems. <laughs> Exhibit I have a. a confession. I, I am yes, a Christian, bro. but I'm gay. <laughs> but so quote laser damn that only got him down just a little and then he immediately begins to overpower her and after what act of retaliation her weapons are already deceased i'm telling you she's useless you yeah. dial it back and she's all like like, bro, I hate when the bench starts talking like they started. Yes. Look at her face. She don't even believe herself. Yes. Thank God she got the glow up in the next one. Because this story right here, uh, I don't know, Slime. Yes. And we get back to T'Challa. And all 21 savages start beating on my friends. And it's actually sad. Every hit giving him a glimpse of another ancestor. But he sees that Shuri's two seconds away from getting carried by the casket peeps. And he's like, remove yourself. And this right here is where we get to the action. Killmonger about to pack her up. But oh! And they start boxing like it's DBZ, and they was really smoothing. The Chala rocks him and tries to push him off, only for Killmonger to swim back in and grab his leg. But that ain't free, stupid, and gets kicked right into the wall. And while they're scaling the building, they jump off and start trading straight blows. And I know I said they, but I really just mean to Chala. This no allows was getting his face beat in. Look at that knee right. Knee again with a lob to the face. Mm. Hit him so hard he moved up against gravity. <laughs> Only for my boy to get hold by the infrastructure and land it on his back. Killmonger lands and they start going back to back. Only for Killmonger to throw him into T'Challa hits this. Mm. 
right into a Dragon Ooh. Ball clash. It was a beautiful exchange, but once they land, they get to yapping. When I'm hearing Killmonger say, I needed Wakanda. I was in the trenches. I don't know about y'all, but it was sounding a lot like this. I can't eat. <laughs> I'm broke, no. nigga. I'm broke. And you got the power to change that, Kev. But hey, I don't blame him. Just give me my money. money. I'd be feeling too. <laughs> they run at each Lawyer taking by ways is the movie. Branchy Jackson going off for a bow wow. Each other in this part of the fight is just crazy. With the music going OD and the choreography snapping. <laughs> Incredible. Incredible. You have no idea how good the MCU was. But this scene might have been too cold. It took us six years to realize Killmonger went zero for ten in an elimination game. Cause people just parry, miss, miss again, parry, block. He got so desperate he tried to go for the toes. Dan Schneider. Don't the self alley. Mm. It was clean but no cigar and they ended in no luck. We went through that entire segment and not a single hit landed. We're Wait, done no, with phase no, one. This man is a fraud. Cause T'Challa really puts it on him by hitting the knife in the air, hitting a barrel roll, catching the self alley oop in the air, and then stabbing his chest. Like, <laughs> oh, he ate that hole. Oh my god, he ate that hole. He don't miss. He don't miss. Oh my god, bro. It's dick riding. All you do. But the fight ends. We get one of my favorite death scenes in fiction with no exaggeration. I'm not even going to meme it. I'm going to just let it play. With my ancestors that jumped from the ships. Because they knew death was better, better than bondage. And that ends the battle. That was a heavy. That was a really good line, too. Really great line dialogue. And when that fight ends, we get back to the battlefield. And they got all the shorties trapped in together. And we really left for five minutes. And when we come back, well, Kobe's leading this entire operation like dog. What? <laughs> I'm the captain now. And that <laughs> man, get him out of here, coach. But they was all out there surrounded only for the goat to pull up on him. I heard the ah fa and dog I stood up and then I get my boy Mbaku pulling up a smoke. And the first thing he does is throw a fruit nigga to the side. Like hell, that's what I'm talking about, twin. That's love. Like at this point, it's not even glazed. Y'all know it too. He just too raw. He spent two movies fighting with a soup ladle and no one said nothing. That's how he raised the goat. And what Kobe seeing them sauced up was getting tight. He used his rhino to charge right at my brother. He charges right at Mbaku and look at his face, bro. Yeah, he would have got hit clean off. I hate people with no reaction time. This man was about to crash and all he did was scream like, bro, put that energy in breaking. Okoye steps in the way and the rhino stops in his tracks, licking her face. Hey. I ain't no rhino, but I do the same thing. <laughs> it's stupid, right? My fault. Yeah, that's brother stop. <laughs> yeah, seriously. <laughs> well, Koye tells him to drop his weapon, and while Kabi's low key flabbergasted, he's like, You would kill me? And I don't even know why he's shocked. He tried to kill her two minutes ago. Yeah, Y'all see just... how men never put the same standards on themselves? Yeah, bro, I can't be with a woman who don't wipe her ass. <laughs> Nick, <laughs> and she's like, For my set? Without question. And my boy started moving like guts. A black woman is speaking. <laughs> Listen and learn, and he drops the weapon, and in the battle. This video was so fun to make. I can run a Black Panther 2 as well. Let me know if y'all want it. Sadly, yeah. my glorious Black King is not in that movie, but I got some other Black protagonists I can definitely glaze. Like, <laughs> if I ever run up this. Blade. <laughs> I love that. I'll see y'all next time. All right. Oh, yeah, I love to see about Black Panther Come Forever recap and a Blade recap. Real, real stuff. Well, overall, there will be recaps that fire. Oh, man. But, yeah, um... That last fight with um and my Panthers actually was cool as hell. I'm not gonna lie, that was actually cool as hell, man. It makes me want to see the first one again because I've I've seen it when, two years ago when Wakanda Forever came out. But hey, look, why not? I'm gonna give it a shot again. But overall, W recap Zephyr keep up the great work. So Hot Squad, that is my conclusion of my Hot Banger recap reaction to Zephyr's Black Panther recap. So if you enjoyed this, please hit that button, share your thoughts. It means a lot to me. And also, have you seen Black Panther? How many times have you seen this? And do you think it's where they're one of the best MC movies and one of the best movie movies of all time? So Hot Squad, I have one more Hot Banger recap I want to get to today. I'm actually feeling tired as heck because I just got from work but I'm up from one more by the way so I will continue more of it tomorrow and Thursday for the rest of the week so Hot Squad please stay tuned because I have my Sensei John Wayne chapter 4 recap in a few moments so please stay tuned